After more than 4 months of intense fighting, you may be wondering, who is winning the war? However, this isn't an easy answer. This really depends on the definition of winning set by respective government. Russia has many objectives, some of which are propaganda and some of which has been revised. Ukraine's objective is to defend itself and restore its borders. Not to mention, this war also devastated the economies of both countries. But I'll leave this to the economists. In this video, I break down the confirmed losses on both the Russian and Ukrainian side. These are only visually confirmed losses supported by photo or video evidence, so the actual number could be higher. This also includes equipment that are damaged beyond repair or captured by opposing forces. In terms of aircraft losses, Russia lost 34 combat aircraft and 1 transport aircraft comprising Su-25, Su-34, Su-30SM, Su-35S and AN-26 transport. The Ukrainians lost 26 combat aircraft and 3 transport aircraft comprising Su-25, MiG-29, Su-24M, Su-27, AN-26 transport and IL-76 transport. In terms of helicopters, Russia lost 49 total, comprising Ka-52, Mi-8, Mi-28, Mi-35M, Mi-24P. Ukraine only lost 11 helicopters, comprising Mi-8, Mi-2, Mi-14, Mi-24. Russia lost a total of 92 UAVs. and Ukraine lost 25 UAVs. In total, Russia lost more air assets as compared to Ukraine. On the ground, Russia lost a total of 824 tanks, the majority being T-72 tanks. On the other hand, Ukraine lost only 200 tanks, the majority being T-64s. Russia lost 1,519 armored vehicles and 1,543 other vehicles. But due to the many different types of vehicles, here is a simplified breakdown. Ukraine lost 202 armored vehicles and 447 other vehicles. Additionally, Russia also lost 88 command posts and communication stations, whereas Ukraine only lost 3. Russia lost 407 artillery and air defense systems. Ukraine lost 175. In summary, Russia lost more ground assets as compared to Ukraine. On the naval front, most of you would have heard of the sinking of the Russian Moskva cruiser. Additionally, the Russian Navy also lost 3 landing ships, 5 patrol boats, and 1 rescue tug. Ukraine lost a total of 18 ships comprising 1 frigate, 8 patrol boats and 9 other vessels. In summary, Ukraine lost more naval assets than Russia. Calculating manpower losses is significantly harder. Russia has 4,238 confirmed losses. Estimates of Russian losses ranges from 16,000 to more than 36,000. Estimates of Ukrainian losses ranges from 10,000 to more than 23,000. Do note that these are only military casualties. Civilian casualties are not included. This also does not include wounded soldiers. According to United Nations, there were 4,889 Ukrainian civilian casualties.